to you about our experiences with cooking in our RV. Our RV came with this um, Furion. It's a convection microwave. And at first we thought, oh, this is great. It's one unit. We'll be able to do all the cooking and microwaving in this and convection. Great, right? Well, until you start using it and you realize while I'm baking something, I can't use the microwave. Plus, when you open the door, it shuts it off. It has a timer. It shuts it off. And you have to remember every time you open the door just to check on something, it shuts it off. Plus, for me, since I'm short, it is over our cooktop. And so when I open the door and go to reach in here, not only does the door want to close on its own, but it's too high for me. I can't look and see what's baking in there. I have burned my arm uh, reaching in, trying to bake things. It just got to be so frustrating that I said, I can't stand this anymore. Let's see if we can find some form of countertop oven and just keep this exclusively as a microwave. So this was our solution. It's the KitchenAid 12 inch convection bake digital countertop oven. The model number on this is KCO273SS for stainless steel. I ordered it on Amazon. It was $179.99. Um, you can look it up on Amazon and of course get all the other great details. I will show you that since it is a 12 inch, it will not hold a 9 by 13 pan. This is a 9 by 13. It's just too big for it. It's really simple to use. It has simple controls and it has some preset temperatures on here, but you can still change it with this knob down here. You have an option of using the convection mode or not. And uh, when you do set the convection mode, it automatically deducts the 25 degree degrees off of your cooking temperature that it's supposed to do for convection. But I love it. It heats up very quickly. It doesn't heat up the rig. It's very lightweight. I pick it up and we store it in our cabinet over there when we're not using it. Um, so this has become a great addition to our cooking and we now, now just use the convection microwave as just a microwave and it's a whole lot easier. This thing also bakes much more evenly than that convection microwave did. The, con that the microwave, I had to set my timer and made sure I turned things every 5-10 minutes or however long because it baked very unevenly and like I said it was too tall for me to even look and see how was it baking. I had to get a step ladder and try and look at it, which I thought this is ridiculous. I need to be able to see. So now this is down at eye level where I can actually see what's going on. You can move the tray to different uh, levels if you want to. And um, it's just a much better situation. I highly recommend it.